Bella and the Cats, The Whiskered Train Adventure Once upon a time, in the bustling town of Whiskerhaven, there lived a spirited nine-year-old girl named Bella. Bella had a peculiar talent. She could tell the funniest cat jokes in the neighborhood. One day, as she gathered her feline friends, Lenny, the big black cat, Lucky, the clever tabby cat, and Lovey, a lovable gray cat, she hatched a plan, a whisker-twitching adventure, to visit her beloved grandma who goes by Mama. Bella and her trio of whiskered companions decided to embark on a train ride to reach Mama's cozy home. The adventure began with Bella leading her cats to the train station each cat donning a tiny conductor's hat. Why did the cat sit on the computer? Because it wanted to keep an eye on the mouse, Bella giggled, setting the tone for the delightful journey. As they boarded the train, Bella, Lenny, Lucky, and Lovey found their seats and settled in for the ride. Lucky, always the curious one, couldn't resist exploring the train compartments. What did the cat say to the train conductor? Are you kitten me right meow? Lucky quipped, causing a chorus of laughter for passengers. Midway through the journey, Bella and the cats decided to visit the dining car for some snacks. Lovey, with her enchanting eyes, charmed the snack vendor into giving them extra catnip flavored treats. Why don't cats take tests in the jungle? Too many cheetahs, Bella teased, sharing the goodies with her feline crew. The train rattled on, and as they approached Mama's town, excitement bubbled among Bella and the cats. Lenny, with his strong paws, flexed his muscles earning amused looks from fellow passengers. Why did the cat become a personal trainer? To help others get in perfect shape, Lenny playfully declared, drawing giggles from kids and adults alike. Finally, they arrived at Mama's station. Bella, Lenny, Lucky, and Lovey disembarked, their hearts full of anticipation. Mama stood on the platform, waving her arms with joy. The reunion was heartwarming, with whiskers and hugs exchanged. Mama, a cat enthusiast herself, welcomed Bella and her furry companions with open arms. The visit to Mama's house turned into a flurry of whiskered activities. Bella and her cats explored every nook and cranny discovering cozy corners and sunlit spots. Why do cats sit on the windowsill? To keep an eye on the neighborhood perspective, Lovey whispered, gazing out the window. The day unfolded in a tapestry of joy filled with laughter, stories, and cat antics. Lucky even managed to showcase her impressive puzzle-solving skills, leaving Mama in awe. As the sun dipped below the horizon, Mama gathered everyone for a delightful evening of cat-themed jokes and games. Why did the cat become a singer? Because it had perfect pitch, Mama chuckled, capping off the day with a perfectly amusing joke. Bella, Lenny, Lucky, and Lovey snuggled together, basking in the warmth of family and feline camaraderie. As night fell, Bella and her trio of cats bid Mama farewell, promising to return for more adventures. Boarding the train back to Whiskerhaven, they shared stories and jokes, creating memories that would linger like the purring echoes of contentment. And so, the Whiskered Train adventure concluded, leaving Bella, Lenny, Lucky, and Lovey with hearts brimming with love and laughter. 
as they arrived back in Wesker Haven, Bella couldn't help but reflect on the day's joys, a grand adventure filled by friendship, family, and endless charm of whiskered companions. The end. <laughs>